Bye bye garden, you have been very fun for the 30 seconds I stayed in you. Ah, ah. <laughs> oh man. Newport bus station, we meet again. But we're not getting a bus. No, no. Because we are walking to Cumbran. The time is currently nine o'clock in the mornings. I haven't eaten anything. Um, I got water and a banana. And yeah, and this is the start of the journey. Let's go on an adventure. <laughs> so this is Newport Castle. You used to be able to go through here. There used to be a walkway going through and you could go through the actual thing. Look at that. There you go, it was founded by the Earls of Stafford, 1372. So this was built in 1372. It's a shame you can't go over there. You used to be able to go through that little door there. It used to go around, but now we have to go this way. As you can see today, I am filming from the other side of my camera. Um, I can't see what I'm filming, so I hope everything is good. Hey, Echo! <laughs> is that a raven? It's a raven! Got a signpost here, guys, telling us where everything is. Apparently the railway station's that way. But it's not, the railway station's over there. Maybe it means... I don't know what it means. I really need a pee started this adventure without urinating. It's not good. Oh, so, in the comments guys, let me know if you think this camera angle is better. So if I remember correctly, we have to go, we have to go on the other side of the road, and then we go, there should be like a little, a little tunnel under this road. So, um, that's what we're gonna take, and hopefully we find some graffiti. We now start our descent to the Newport Tunnel. Um, it's the only way to get across the road without uh, risking my life. Here we go, look at all this graffiti in there. That's pretty good. Some graffiti is really good, right? Well, other graffiti is not so good. Like, I think that's quite good. That must have took someone quite a long time to do. Was it Sonic? Sonic. What an awesome little place. I see that a lot as well. I see that. I've seen that somewhere. The happy and the sad equals meh. Or someone's gone mez. Hmm. Very interesting. That's quite interesting too. As I say, go. It looks better on my phone than it does through my eyes. That was kind of like Disneyland, but for Newport. <laughs> you go for a little ride and you see all the cool attractions. <laughs> so the ride's over now, look. We are on the other side of the death road. And we are at the first part of our journey to Kumpran. So here's a cool fact about me, guys, that you probably didn't know, that I'm allergic to about 90% of fruit. Um, apples, any citrusy kind of things. I can't open my banana. Mm. But I can eat bananas, which is a good thing, because I'm trying to eat a little bit healthier. And bananas is gonna be my breakfasts from now on. Don't think about bananas. 
I don't like the texture. Mmm. <laughs> I want to take you down this road, Malpas Road, because there's something I want to show you guys. Show you a little bit of history of me and kind of the first place I stayed in Newport. The first house me and Amanda got together, you know? So that means a lot. And the fact that there's a big crack in the wall and mildew was just like pouring in and I got really ill. Um, yeah, it wasn't too bad. I think it was like 350 pound a month. But then we called the environmental health yeah, on the guys and the rent went up by a hundred quid. <laughs> oh yeah, the Oliver Rose. We used to live in that flat above it there. But the problem with living down here, look, we've got a fish and chip shop next door, we've got an Indian there, you've got a kebab shop there, and you have a shop, oh it's gone, the shop in the corner. And you had an Indian restaurant there, which is amazing by the way, that's Shabaraj. Amazing, amazing. We used to go, actually me and Amanda used to go in there and have meals. But then we used to have takeaway, so we live by there. Um, we've got a Premier Inn down by there. And across the road by here, you got this place. They used to do amazing burgers and breakfast rolls and stuff. And then down by here, you got um, you got a Chinese. We're talking about seven years, eight years. Bloody hell! Time flies when you're having fun, eh? So we're gonna get on the path now to the canal, which is gonna take us into the journey across Middle Earth into the land they call Kumbran. It is quite a trek for a man of my structure, but um, it's good, it's good for me. And I'm gonna enjoy it and we're gonna get some fresh air and hay fever's gonna kill me, but hey, doing it for the vlog. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is where the adventure starts upon my perilous journey. Oh, Tombalam over there, look. It's like straight ahead. We're not doing Tambalam today, but next week, maybe? Depends how this goes. This should go pr pretty good. I can't see this being a horrible walk because there's not many hills. And uh, it's nice, it's pretty. I've had my hay fever tablets. Let's go and have a look at this bridge. Oh, there's allotments here, look. Now, I just want to let you know on this adventure, I'm not going to be filming the whole thing, just cool bits, like this bridge. Oh, duck. We want to make this a vlog exciting and fun. And I just want to thank you for watching. If you are here, amazing. Thank you so much for watching these vlogs. Uh, it means the world to me that people are interested in me and I'm interesting. I try and be quite fun. I try and do fun things. But at the minute with COVID and my hay fever, my hay fever two days ago was so bad, I thought I was dying. <laughs> so we can go two ways now. We can go this way which goes to 14 locks and cross keys. Oh, hey, that might be a vlog. 14 vlogs. Vlogs. 14 vlogs, 14 locks. Oh, cool, look at this. Oh, well, apparently, come brand's only three, like, three, three miles. But it says there, come brand's five miles. I still want to say it's eight miles. So we could go that way, which we're not going to go. We're going to go this way. Under the bridge, this is the M4, I believe. Now, look how dark it is, and yeah, it's really deep. And this goes on. I don't think they use the canal anymore. Well, it doesn't look like they use it. Hey, mate, Jade. I always find things like this quite cinematic. I don't know all the symmetricalness. Is that a word? But look at that. Ugh. Darkness. I'd like to throw a light in there to see what lights up. See you. See like mermans moving around. Ready to pounce upon thee. What a beautiful day. What a beautiful day to walk to Cumbran from Newport. The bird, the sun shining, the birds are singing, the water's watering and yeah, we just had a little adventure. It's a nice five miles. So from the house to here, well, another three. You know, so we're looking about eight mile, an eight mile walk. So very nice. 
Morning. 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 Is that your dog? That's my dog. What's his yeah. name? Hello. <laughs> Doesn't like me. Hello. <laughs> the dog's barking at me as I walk away. But when I try and smooth it, it runs me. <laughs> it's like real life with real girls. I'm joking. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Here's the first kind of pit stop. This is, because it is, it used to be a canal. Um, then it's amazing kind of looking, looking bridge look. And it's got some history. Monmouthshire and Brecon Canal. Built over 200 years ago. Um, so they used to basically get the coal from the mountain and bring it down here. These are the kind of wildlife we expect. Rats, oh, rats, not bats. Otis, dragonflies, and a kingfisher, which is an Alcedo. How cool this looks! Ooh. So, what they would do, see, they would close these gates and let the water in so it would rise, and then the boat would continue along the canal. And then it would be the same the other way around. So, when the boats are coming this way, they'd sail into here. They'd open the doors very slowly, and I'd release water, and then it can continue into the canal. Down to wherever they go with their packages. If I drop my phone, I am a bugger, basically. I, I'd have to go and get it, but I don't really want to. Ugh. Morning. Morning. Don't think about driving No, in. no. I was more concerned about dropping my phone. <laughs> Good thing is as well, so far everyone I've met has been really, really nice. So, story number one. This bridge, okay? When I was young, younger, in my younger days, I used to meet this girl. She used to live up here somewhere in Malpas, and she used to meet me by here. And we used to kiss. <laughs> five miles. Still five miles. So this is the first kind of like, first and only crossing, I think. There's not many, um, any roads now this way. I've um, got a bin. I'm looking at the bin. Ugh, dog poo. I can see that, I was looking for my camera. Ooh, there's another lock. Ooh. I would like just to thank you guys, if you are still here watching the vlog. Oh, look at that tree. <laughs> it's been cut. It's like a sword with a sword. If you are still watching this vlog, thank you very much. Um, I hope it's okay. I hope I'm keeping you entertained with my little stories and stuff. Um, <laughs> let's make some random noises. Us and the nature. Oh wow, look at that view of Tumbalum. Now I can't see anything because I've put my phone on the lowest by brightness so I can film this way and it saves a bit of battery but um these all the farmhouses and stuff yeah awesome oh little sign what does it say um I can't see anything on my phone there because it's too bright Monmouthshire and Brecon Canal and they've got some graffiti um sprayed over the map of the canal um got some like history things here uh, I can't really read anything because uh, because of the vandals. Oh, look at that. There's a cockerel on top of the tree. Then you can see that. How cool is that? Do you salute cockerels? I don't know. Was it magpies? I don't know. I just saluted the uh, cockerel. Because I'm weird. It looks like a uh, Charlie Chocolate Factory. Mmm. It's a river of chocolate. That's, that's an issue, that's some chocolate milk. <laughs> Look at that. Amazing bird. Why's it got his feathers up though? Oh, he's going for something. Oh, he's stuck in the reins.
and it's good for you. Stuff like this is good. If you are stressed and you're feeling a bit crap, just go for a walk. Try and find something like this. Because um, this is amazing. Like, I wouldn't know this existed if I didn't find it when I was younger. <laughs> but um, again, another amazing thing in Newport. Um, Newport and Bran, outskirts of Newport. I don't know. But it's nice, it's peaceful, and it feels good for the soul, you know? I've always found countryside is good for the soul. So if you're feeling a bit crappy, guys, just go for a nice walk in the countryside somewhere. Get some of that fresh air. This time you can go under the bridge. Let's do that. So this is Hollybush 28. Bridge number 28. Ooh. Whoa. Got all that. It's like salt or something. I don't know why no one's got no boats. Go to have a little boat and just like go for a little sail. You probably can't go far, but it'd be nice, I guess. Well, there you go. There's the other swan, look. On its nest. Look at this nest. I've never seen a swan nest before. But we are still in the leg of our journey. Um, so far, so good. Everyone I've spoke to is really, really nice. Um, and that's what it's all about, isn't it? Getting out, meeting people. I think I can do a school. Um, no filming the school. I'm like in the middle of nowhere. And there's a bloody school. What's going on? Amazing. So nice. Look at the colours. That's a cool looking tree. And another bridge. I think I'm coming to the end now of like the houses and the, all the houses and stuff. And it's going to go that way over into. The land of Cumbran. Um, another bridge to walk under. See what it takes us. Sounds like a giant bee. Oh, wow, look at that. So I believe this here is salt. So now we're just going to be us. And the countryside. And look. I can breathe without my hay fever kicking my ass. Look at what he has. Whoa, look at this house. Look at that amazing house. Very nice. Morning. I've said morning to every single person I've seen so far, and it's uh, feels nice. What bird is that? Look. Hi, mate. Hi, mate. You are my new friend. You are called Herring. I'm sure it's a herring. Was that a fish? Hey mate. Oh. It's like a dinosaur. <sighs> Goddamn steepness. Try to kill me over here. This one has running water. Somewhere. Oh, 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 just to show you. It's gonna blow! Hmm. Hmm. I'm guessing we go straight. I can't remember this bit. I haven't got a clue. 
Meh. Meh! Who needs maps? That had to be the best morning. Going to bike one past him. Morning. He went, no, 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 no. Because he's right, because he was sweating. We've been riding his bike too hard. He can speak. No, 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 no. Hmm. Hmm. Poop. You know, this is the first lock I've seen so far with a ladder. Oh. Should I climb down there? No! <laughs> I won't be able to get back up. Morning. 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 I think it's the first time since the walk since you can actually see country fields. Because I've been surrounded by all these bushes and trees. But now, you can see countryside. Can you hear something over there? I think it's a motorway. I'm not too sure. <gasps> oh, oh God. Oh, it's not very safe. Oh, it just leads to the other side of the, leads to nowhere really. Morning. Hey, Morning. Morning, bud. Somebody has constructed a ceremony garden where you come to be sacrificed. And I go sit in this little garden. This looks really nice. And drink some water. <coughs> oh, look at this. Should have brought more bananas. Bye bye garden, you have been very fun for the 30 seconds I stayed in you. Ah, ah. <laughs> Song on my arm. Ah, get this one. Proper, proper flowing down here. Ooh. Quite relaxing. Where's the water coming from then? This thing's a hot poo. I believe this here is the end. And that is the end of that. Um, if you keep it going that way, but what I used to do was to come up here and I used to go that way back to my house where I used to live. Um, so yeah, so that's the whole journey. That was five miles. Five mile hike. Plus the, the three or two into town. I will check at the end of the vlog. Um, it'll appear now. How many steps I did. So, or how many miles I walked according to my phone. So yeah, so awesome. Thank you very much for watching the vlog. I hope it wasn't too boring for you guys. It's really loud up here because of all the cars. Because I've reached civilization again. So thank you very much for watching the vlog. Um, don't forget, if you did like the vlog, give me a little like, a little thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed to our channel, hit the subscribe button because we've got so much more adventures coming. Um, and there's so many different places I could have gone. I could have went the other way and see where that went. So yeah, awesome. So thank you very much for watching the vlog. You are most welcome here. Please, put what, if you didn't like the vlog, mention the comments. Um, awesome. And I hope you like the new way I filmed the, the vlogs with the, the wide lens. So thank you very much. And I will see you all very soon.